So the internet's currently divided by who would win in a fight. 100 men or one gorilla, no weapons allowed. Let's end the debate with science and go through the major anatomical differences because the final answer might surprise you. So the average 30 year old man in peak physical shape is about 5'9 and weighs 80 kilograms. And let's be generous and say they can bench press 100 kg. Now a gorilla, a fully mature silverback in the wild stands 5'5 five five upright, but weighs about 180 kg. So if it just sat on you alone, that's enough weight to crush your rib cage. And a gorilla's bones are up to twice as thick as our human bones, which are also more porous. And if you pair that with a gorilla's bite force of around 1,300 psi, nearly double a lines, it could bite through a human female like how we bite through a raw carrot. And did you know 50% of a gorilla's body is muscle, with a high percentage of type 2B fibers, which are perfect for short explosive violence. And considering gorillas walk on all fours, this knuckle walking adaptation gives them heavily reinforced wrists and forearms, which means they have a punching power that's like being hit by a car at 30 miles per hour. And a gorilla's grip strength is about 500 kg, so yes, it could absolutely crush a human human skull with its bare hands. At this point it feels like game over, but humans have something that gorillas don't endurance. Our muscles are a mix of type 1 and type 2A fibers which are built for aerobic efficiency and long durations, but gorillas don't have this which means they're all power but no stamina. They also don't sweat meaning they overheat fast especially under stress. And most importantly the human brain is almost three times larger, so our advantage is being able to strategize and coordinate attacks. So yes the gorilla would absolutely obliterate the first 20 men, but if the group attacked in waves, they used distraction, rotated for rest and also focused on controlling the limbs, the gorilla would eventually gas out and be overcome by the sheer numbers. Of course, this is purely hypothetical. I love gorillas and rest in peace Harambe, but send this to your group chat at the end of the bay and follow if you're curious about anything health or medical related.